Hello, this message is for fire signs, Aries, Leos, and Sag for March 3rd, 2019, and general message. Okay, um, so I shuffled in, cut the cards, and I laid everything out, as you guys can see, okay? Um, the first deck I used was the Archangel Oracle deck, okay, and you got three messages from them. Fire signs, you have counselor, you have comfort, it says I am working, I'm sorry, it says I am with you in your time of need, helping your heart to heal, okay, you could be going through something, maybe some kind of past hurts, okay, where so you were needing some type of counseling, um, with, okay, um, your heart is still healing from this situation that you dealt with. Um, and you have gifts from God, okay? It says, we angels bring you gifts from your creator. Open your arms to receive them, okay? You could be not wanting <laughs> a new start or a new beginning because of some past hurts. Because your heart is still healing from a situation, Maybe there's a need for you to seek some kind of counseling to heal these pains or this old wounding. Okay. Um, also, this is saying that you are a natural counselor. You know, a lot of people benefit from your guidance and basically the guidance that you give about healing your heart and stuff like that. And that is a gift from God that you have these abilities to help these people. Okay. Now with your romance angel cards, you have calling in your soulmate. Okay, your prayers and affirmation bring you, I'm sorry, in realizations help bring you together, okay? <sighs> Chemistry. There's a strong magnetic attraction here, reconciliation, and worth waiting for. Divine timing is at work in your love life, okay? So, with your romance angel cards, I'm getting that, okay, you are ready for a new beginning with a love, okay? This could be someone from your past because you have the reconciliation card, um, but it's divine timing. So right now is the perfect time for you guys to get back together or to reestablish um, some type of relationship because there is a strong magnetic attraction here between the two of you. This is definitely a soulmate. Okay. Um, maybe a twin flame. Okay. Now I pulled your tarot. Okay. And, um, you have the king of cups. So, um, fire signs, you're thinking head over heart right now, you know, logically about a brand new passionate creative endeavor with the Ace of Wands that you want to start. Could be uh, a reconciliation, basically, that you want to get back with somebody. So you're thinking long and hard, like how should you go about it? You're trying to think uh, less emotional because uh, your heart was hurt, okay, in this situation. But you do want to get back with someone that you do have a strong magnetic attraction to, okay? Like I said, they could definitely be a soulmate. All right, um, fire signs. Um, then we have temperance, okay? There is a need of, for balance, head and heart, okay? That's what this King of Cups is. Balancing your head and heart, okay, about the situation. Uh, tower after a tower moment that you may have had with this person, okay? You could have lived with them, okay? Uh, you lived in the same home. Maybe the found it was a faulty foundation. Maybe the relationship was built up on an imbalance. Some kind of imbalance was in your relationship, okay? Fire signs. Then you have the six of cups, okay? Your six of cups is you reminiscing and thinking about the past. Uh, this person that you want to reconcile with, okay? That you feel maybe a, they are a gift from God, okay? Um, and you're like, you know, really thinking hard, long and hard about this person because they gave you the Ten of Cups, okay? You were very happy. Could have had a family with this person, could have lived together, okay? Um, but you guys definitely had something established already, okay? They could be a Cancer Pisces or a Scorpio. But we have the Magician here, okay? You're trying to manifest this lover back into your life, okay? Divine timing is at work here, Okay, um, divine timing. Okay, it's very important. Fire signs, divine timing is very important in a relationship because even though it won't happen when you want it to happen, 
um god has bigger plans okay god always has the last say or the say so in all of the matters of if a situation should be or not now this is um the lover's card here you could be dealing with a gemini or have gemini in your chart now the lover's card is two people that are divinely guided to be together okay which hints that worth waiting for okay um so this situation will definitely get, come back together okay because it's supposed to but you are trying to manifest this. You have all of the tools that you need, okay? You see how he has everything that he needs to manifest this soulmate. You can see the eight, uh, the infinity sign over his head. So this is their soulmate for sure. The person that you do want to come back into your life because they gave you life, basically. They gave you some good love, okay? Um, and you feel like this is the person that you need to be with, okay? For sure. All right. And then you have the... Eight of Pentacles. So you've been working hard on your money. You've been working hard on your craft, working hard on yourself. Or there is still a need for you to work on something within yourself, which would probably be if if it was if you do have Gemini in your chart of somewhere, uh, maybe in your Venus. OK, um, there is a strong need for you to work on equal give and take or actually work on you being in a committed relationship and not having other lovers okay because that's what's causing delays here with the hangman okay but you do have the hangman here so there may be something some delay here um with this relationship getting back together okay maybe due to working okay maybe due to some eight of pentacles type of situation whereas though that you need to still put in the work or do the work so that the situation can be back together you really want this but you are not willing to put in the work okay so which is causing a delay all right um fire signs like i said you this is definitely a person this is definitely a soulmate for sure okay like i said six of cups Somebody that bring, that you do want to have a family with or you could see having a family with or you already have this family with this person. 99, I'm really feeling like 99.9% .9 of the time you guys already have a family with this person. Okay, but there was a tower moment here. Okay, because it was an imbalance here in the relationship. Okay, there wasn't an equal give and take. Okay, you could be dealing with a Sagittarius, but there wasn't an equal give and take here. Okay, so the tower hit. Okay, there wasn't an equal giving of emotions, okay, love back and forth between the two of you, okay, and you're really thinking long and hard, you know, trying to not be as emotional, okay, in the situation, could be done with a Cancer Pisces or a Scorpio, but you do want to start this brand new passionate creative endeavor again, you do want this person back, okay, so right now you're calling in your soulmate, okay, um, you probably tried to get over this person in the past, but, uh, there's a strong magnetic attraction. So with those, with these kind of cards, okay, it's kind of hard to get over someone that you have that are, you are divinely guided to be with. Okay. Maybe this person is a teacher or you learned something from this person. Okay. Maybe they counseled you. Okay. Maybe this person made you, you know, brought out a different side of you. Okay. Um, in the relationship that you probably wasn't expecting okay so fire signs um this reconciliation looks like it is worth waiting for and you probably been waiting for the right time to even spring this on to this person and i'm feeling like with this mercury retrograde i think around this time is going to be the time that you actually make this decision to do what you have to do and go for it and actually contact this person that you are wanting to be with someone that you had a family with. Okay. Um, so fire signs, this is your read. Okay. I hope that this helped. If you want a personal read from me, all my information is in the description box below. So I would say definitely fire signs. Okay. Um, divine timing is here and I would say, do it okay go for it but you have to put the work in okay because if you don't nothing is going to happen <laughs> nothing is going to move okay with the hangman okay put the work in that you need to put the put into it okay put the love the attention the affection the emotion everything that you need to put into it okay maybe in the past there wasn't you know a lot of emotion here when you started this this passionate creative endeavor with this person because the king of cups is not that emotional okay he's more logical okay so um this is your reading fire fire signs and um i hope this helped like i said talk to you later bye